Hello there, people. It's Rob Tackle Box here. I got me some new beer to review, so we're gonna review this some bitch right here, right here. Budweiser, copper lager, Jim Beam, aged on real barrel staves. Okay, check this shit out. Beautiful bottle. I love this this color and the label right there. Sorry I'm in the sunlight out here in my truck. And they're on a little bit. Turn that down so you don't hear the damn air conditioner. It's a beautiful bottle. I love the cap too there. Check that thing out right there. I'm going to keep these caps. Make something out of them. Look at that. It's beautiful. Damn majestic American Eagle Budweiser. Okay, let's see what it says right up here at the top. I can read this old son bitch. It says this is a flavorful American copper lager brewed with two row barrel a uh, two row barley and aged on real Jim Bean bourbon barrel staves for toasted oak aroma a deliciously nutty taste oh my uh, nutty taste with a caramel rye and vanilla notes and a smooth finish well let's see about that Nice twist off there. There's some foam coming out. I mean, not foam, uh, some some mist and some vapor. But I really do like these little, that little cap right there. That's a pretty thing. I'm going to keep these glue them on something, man. Look pretty. Make some decorations. But yeah, it is 6.2% alcohol by volume. Let's give it a smell. It, it's just got the beer smell so far from what I'm smelling. It smells good. I can't complain. It's not off putting smell. I don't have the best smell of the smeller on me now. I don't smell a whole lot, but it smells like beer. Let's taste this, some bitch. You can kind of taste the caramel. I can taste the caramel, caramel, whichever way you want to say it. I can taste that right there. It is smooth. I'll give it that. When I was uh, I, I was uh, hearing about these and looking about them, I said that's probably gonna have a weird taste to it. You know, maybe off putting because I'm used to regular old Budweiser and that kind of shit. But th it tastes damn good. It it does taste like Budweiser, but it does have a different taste. Like I said, there's a little bit more caramel there. It might be some of that vanilla. I might can taste some of it. It's pleasant whatever it is it does have an aftertaste uh, to me most of the taste are on that swallow and it's coming back up it's got a aroma to it coming back up your palate there you know at the aftertaste not when it's in your mouth you swallow that some bitch uh, i can definitely taste the caramel it's got that kind of candy-ish taste while it's going down it's, it's pretty good damn beer. I, I suggest this while it is a select product. It's not going to be around forever. And uh, I didn't get a chance to taste the other, uh, the, the George Washington. Well, I forget the damn name of some bitch. I could never get a hold of it. But, uh, uh, <coughs> excuse me. But, yeah, this here Copper Lager by Budweiser, aged in the Jim Bean. It's, it's good stuff right here. I recommend it. I mean, I know I'm saying all kinds of good stuff about everything, but this one right here, you can't say nothing bad. It is smooth. It does taste different than Budweiser, what you want with something special like this. I love the bottle. Nice little bottle there, dark. Love the label coloring. Beautiful. I mean, just looks pleasant on the eyes. It tastes good. It's smooth. You can drink these some bitches down. It's the perfect amount, in my opinion, of taste and drinkability. It's got some good taste. And like I said, I can't taste a whole hell of a lot. You know, I don't have the most sensitive taste buds, but this here, it, it you can taste the goodness. I like Bud, well, I like full flavored beers. And uh, this definitely has flavor, but it's not too overpowering where you don't want to, you know, it's not too strong. You can drink a few of these some bitches just like Ken Budweiser. So I highly suggest you pick up some of these and give them a try at least. Limited time, get you a six pack of these things. What I got, beautiful little six pack carrier too. The, the cardboard little carriers, I'm keeping that thing. It's nice. But yes, it's good. And I, I do suggest uh, picking them up and trying them out. 
This has been my review. I'm Rob Tacklebox of Budweiser Copper Lager, Jim Bean Aged. And uh, I am Rob Tacklebox, and I will take this time to say if you like this video and you're watching, thank you for watching and putting up with me. Give it a like if you like, dislike if you don't. Please subscribe if you can. I just want to get up to 100 uh, so I can get my name on the URL, man. It's not a bad uh, goal to have, 100 people. It's not that bad. But yeah, follow me on Instagram if you want to. I post some funny pictures, videos on there, whatnot. That's at Rob Tacklebox. And follow me on Twitter. That's at Rob Tacklebox. Keeping it real simple for you because I know I like it simple. I can't remember all that shit. But yeah, please subscribe. And I thank you for watching this. This has been my review of Budweiser Copper Lager. It's good shit. I'm a fan of Anheuser-Busch and Budweiser, so I say they've done good right here. And uh, I appreciate it if you watch my shit. Thank you for watching it. Love you, guy.